HIV, TB, malaria, gastroenteritis, pneumonia, t- all those diseases are diseases of poverty. The AIDS epidemic in the United States, we have to address it. We have 50,000 infections every year in the United States. It's plateaued. We don't make a dent in it. Eating disorders has increased by over 65% in the last two decades. About one third or more of the homeless have treatable mental health problems, but are not receiving treatment for them. But whether you're in the medical profession or in in the public, if you're in Liberia or in America, people who got the same illness, the same virus, in the same place, had completely different outcomes. Not because it's a poor country, not because things were not available. What's really killing these people is the lack of a healthcare system attempts to control disease and improve health globally is linked to the way we've socially constructed these diseases and the responses to these diseases. So if you're thinking about global health, you don't have to go very far to make a difference. Small steps and small changes add up to something big and profound.